Thomas here with Much Props. Uh, gonna make another build for you. This one's a little different than what I've done before. Recently I got to go on a trip to Ireland uh, and on our trip one day we got to go to an island off of the coast of Ireland known as Skellig Michael. If you don't know what that is, um, it's an island that a bunch of monks uh, kind of sheltered themselves away from the rest of the world and were basically practicing their religion and writing manuscripts and stuff all secluded on their own. You may have heard of this recently as a place where Star Wars has shot part of The Force Awakens. Um, so in tribute to my trip and my nice pretty shirt with May the Force Be With You in Gaelic, um, I am going to do a model build of a TIE Fighter. Um, this particular one I picked up at uh, a hobby store uh, for like seven dollars. Uh, it was one of those discounted items. I, I don't know why, but sometimes Hobby Lobby puts stuff in a discount. Seven dollars. Yeah, I'm a buyer. I'm going to build this, but I'm not just going to make it regular, put together, snap together. I'm going to make it battle damaged and crashed into the desert. I recently saw a video by Cosplay Chris. Uh, which inspired me to do my own. Uh, I'm going to use foam as my base instead of doing all the stuff that he did in his video. Uh, I'm just going to use regular EVA floor mat foam, put it on there, chop it up, distort it a little bit, uh, and go from there. So I want it to hopefully look like something like that. That's the goal. So, let's get the goal.
cutter is finished. Um, all together, I think I spent 10 bucks. Um, I always save scrap materials, broken controllers, um, leftover electronics or when I upgrade, uh, and then I use those to add to my props to make them more realistic because I like my props to look dirty and worn and sometimes broken. Uh, I think the end result kind of speaks for itself. The wires really kind of sell it for me. And all the little burn marks. I don't know if you noticed when I was doing the wires. Uh, parts of it, I just used a lighter and I set it on fire. And it gives it that burnt, bubbled texture. Uh, and I think it really kind of makes the prop. So, leftover NDF, scrap EVA foam, a $7 kit from Hobby Lobby. Uh, and I made a little diorama of a wrecked TIE Fighter. Uh, hopefully you liked this build and maybe you learned something in the process of it. Um, maybe you can do it and show one of your friends and you'll get some... Hooray! And then when they ask you, how'd you do that? You can give them one of these. Tell them much props.